Good morning, everybody. Welcome to episode four of Vale on Hawaii's Art Talk. I'm here, as always, with 15 of my paintings to discuss with you, and all of them are available for purchase. So if you'd like to purchase one of these originals, contact me in the comments or contact me on my social media. I will read the comments and I will respond. So let's get right into it. This one, and I have two different price ranges for these today. This pile is 40, this pile is 50. So I'll reiterate as I go on. This one is called Goddess and Child. It's an interesting, different sort of take on the, the Christmas story where it shows the divinity of the mother, the divinity of the child in a much more female-centric view than the original Christmas story. This one is $40 and there's some beautiful, gorgeous blues, greens, purples all mixed in here. And of course the moon because no feminine empowerment's complete without the moon. Over here, we have autism art. I work at a school for students with special needs and I work with a lot of students with autism. So I created this piece as a way to pay homage to them. Authentic, unique, talented, individual, special masterpiece. That's what every single one of those students is to me. Again, $40 for the original. This one is a beautiful, peaceful, calming scene of an early morning sunrise on the mist. In Well, sunrise behind the mist. Now, if you've noticed on a really misty morning, the sun doesn't have any real illumination. You can look right at it and it won't affect your eyes. And this is what this one's based on. I call this one tranquility because it's a very peaceful, very calming image. And there's a lot of purples and blues mixed into this one. It's a really beautiful piece. $40 for the original. This one is based on the great American eclipse that happened in 2000, I wanna say 17. Yes, it was 2017. I did a couple of different eclipse themed paintings and this is one of them titled appropriately Eclipse. I used some of that metallic paint that I love so much to show the corona, the ring around the sun. And you'll notice there's a little bit of a shimmer inside the blackness. And so this is Eclipse, $40 for the original. Because I, it's not Vale on Hawaii's art talk without at least one outer space themed piece, this is Space Lighthouse. No, Universal Lighthouse, I'm sorry. Universal Lighthouse. Imagine a beautiful lighthouse on another planet showing all the many different travelers of the universe where a safe haven just might be. So this is a really beautiful piece. And my mother is actually quite obsessed with lighthouses. She has several of my original lighthouse paintings, but not this one. This one is up for grabs for $40 for the original. I'm a very, very huge fan of dragonflies, as you can see by my wrist tattoos. Dragonflies are my favorite insect. insect. And this is called Dragonfly Morning. I love the colors in this piece. There's some real vibrancy and beauty here, and it pays tribute to my favorite little insects, the beautiful, mysterious dragonflies. $40 for the original. To close off the $40 ones, I have two more pieces here. This one is called The Traveler. She's basically coming through a hole from another dimension and looking around at what's going on in this particular dimension. So it's another sort of outer space themed one. And she's just popping into another dimension to see what's what. $40 for this one as well. And to finalize the $40 pieces, this one is actually based on the Lorax by Dr. Seuss. It's the death of the last Truffula tree. If you read, if you read Dr. Seuss's books from a non-childlike perspective, there are major social commentaries on some of the true injustices that are going on in this world and greed, human greed is one of the biggest ones. And the very last truffula tree is being cut down. So that's what this one is based on. It's a dark, forbidding, sad feeling. And if you'll notice, the truffula tree almost looks like dark, black factory smoke coming to pollute the world even more. So it's a very evocative piece. This one is also $40 for the original, and that's Death of the Last Truffula Tree. Now we're moving on to a pile of $50 originals that are a little bit bigger. This one is called Swans of Lake Eola. There is a beautiful park in the middle of downtown Orlando, Lake Eola Park, 
and they are famous for their swans. There's a bunch of white swans and there's a bunch of black swans. And one day when I was at that park, I happened to see two of them facing each other and I immediately took a picture because I thought it was the coolest scene. So I decided to paint that exact image. You got your white swan, you got your black swan. And if you're a fan of the ballet or the movie, this is a good one for you. Another one that focuses on duality because many of my paintings do. And this one is $50 for the original for Swans of Lake Eola. This is a funky, interesting abstract one I did some time back. I call this one Vines and Roots because you'll notice these almost look like Christmas trees, but there's these interesting roots, root-like substances anchoring them. And so this one is Vines and Roots, some really pretty colors, stark white background. It's just a funky, cool abstract. So you may see something I don't because that's the coolest thing about abstract art. And this one is $50 for the original. This one is the explosion. We've all had moments where we either lost our temper or had a moment that was so sublime and so joyous that we just, something inside us explodes either with joy or with anger. So this could mean a bunch of different things to a bunch of different people, but regardless, it's an explosion. Very dynamic colors here, some reds, some oranges, some yellows. So this one really kind of punches you in the face and grabs your attention. This one is $50 for the original. This is a cute little piece called Skull Tree. You'll notice in one of my earlier videos, I did one called Tree of Desire. Well, I decided to do a slightly different version that was a little more Halloween-ish. And you'll notice these are all little tiny skulls in the tree and some snow that's dropping off them. So it could kind of be a tribute to A Nightmare Before Christmas as well. And I really like this one. It's just, it's cute. The little skulls are just cute to me. So this one is also $50 for the original. And that's Tree of Skulls or Skull Tree. This one is a special edition that's not even on my website. This one is called Dragonfly Tattoo. And basically where it came from was I was trying to decide where to put my dragonfly tattoo. So I decided, well, let me just paint it and see how it looks on a skin, on my skin tone background with my hair. Ultimately, I went with a different direction for the actual tattoos, but this was an idea that I was playing with. Dragonfly tattoo, that's $50 for the original. Sunrise over the ocean, because again, it's just not Valayanawa'i's art talk unless there's some kind of ocean or sunrise related piece. The ocean here is quite dark, but there's a really nice streak of blue going through here. Your beautiful, stunning sunrise colors and the duality of light and darkness come into play here. This one is also $50 for the original. Well, clearly I'm on quite a dragonfly theme today. Here is my final piece for this episode. This is called First Dragonfly. Not only is it the first dragonfly painting I ever did, how it was also the idea was this is the very first dragonfly that was ever created, the ancestor of all dragonflies, the very primordial dragonfly, if you will. So there's a lot of beautiful colors and blue and green, um, I'm sorry, purple and green are my two favorite colors. So I wanted to focus on some blue because I think the blue dragonflies are truly magnificent. So I threw my favorite colors in there plus some really nice blue and of course the spirals, because again, it's a volley thing. I love my spirals. So this is First Dragonfly, and it is also available for $50. Now every single one of these, except one, um, are all available on my website as prints and products. And you can go to wwwvale anawaipixelscom That's V-A-L-E-A-N-O-A-I. So check me out, go see my art website. There's over 600 pieces for you to look through. And again, all of these originals are available for purchase. So contact me in the comments if you'd like to purchase one. Have a fabulous week, everybody. And I'll see you next time on Valeanawa'i's Art Talk.